Okay, so this is the card collection book. Um, this is what the page looks like when you when you log into it. Um, it does check your cookies to make sure that you are logged in. Um, so yeah, main page is showing all cards. Um, the cards that you currently own will be in full color and cards that you do not own are grayed out. Um, here at the top, this bit here changes when you change the card type filter here. Um, also down here is contextual filters, so um, there will be more filters that show up depending on the type of card that you've picked. Um, there's arrow buttons here that let you iterate through the pages. You can go through all of the cards. These are all of the cards here. Um, let me show you this here. Okay, so you can pick um, between all avatar, magic, or trap. If you pick avatar, this bit here updates saying avatar cards. Um, the contextual filters change as well. Um, so you can pick based off of class. You can switch it to aquatic and only show the aquatic cards. You can switch it to bug, show the bug cards. Dragon, humanoid, flying, etc. Go back to all. Um, so yeah, you can pick element as well if you want um, fire. Let's say I'll show you all the fire cards. And I'm going to go let's see if there's any size zero cards. There we go. Some size zero ones. Size one is a blazing king. There's no size two cards. Uh, we'll go dark. And you can pick rarities. I'm just gonna go to all cards here and show the rarities. You can show super rare cards, rare cards, common, uncommon. They're all there. Um, you can go to magic cards, and this updates. It goes by effect, target, and rarity as well. Um, you can see these common cards. Sorry, uncommon and common. And you can see um, if you want all targets, whether it be self or enemy targets, you can pick self and it'll just show you the cards you can use on yourself. And then cards you can use on the enemy. And then there's also the effect, um, attack effect, multiply attack, etc. You can go through and it'll... Oh, there's no attack cards there. There we go. All. So attack, effect, uh, all targets. And these are the cards that suit those filters. Um, now we can go back to, we can go to the trap here. Um, when you do change the card type, the, the filters do reset. And you can see for a car, for, sorry, for trap cards, there's only the target and rarity options. You can switch it to super rare. The, it says hall train there. I think it's supposed to be hell train, but that's being pulled off of the, the database. Um, now also, if we go to all cards, you can actually do a search in here, um, like Silver Dragon, there's Silver there, you can do Drag, same thing, um, Imp, goes off of anything, you can do, um, basically you can do the, the name of the card, you can search its class type or element, um, and a few different things, even the uh, description there, so you can do, let's say, Attack. This is the only card that says attack in the description, so skip the attack action. Um, sometimes there's descriptions that say ATK instead, so there you go. All the cards that have ATK in them. Um, let's see, wind. Here's all your wind. Wind monsters. Uh, let's say fly. Here's all your flying ones. Yeah, it's basically it. That's a, a simple search. And you can go back to all cards again and, and look at them all. Um, so yeah, that's basically it. Uh, pulls all the cards off of the database, um, populates all the information from the database and of the cards. And uh, yeah, it's pretty, it's fully functional. It can do quite a bit with it, which is, which is pretty cool. Um, it's also used using Bootstrap, so if you want to uh, apply it with iframes, into into the site itself uh, you can do that it works nice on like mobile devices and everything as well so so yeah that's it that's the car collection book and hopefully you like it